straighten out the mess that's usually in the room when we get here and get set up so the band has everything ship shape and in readiness for them when they get here. They work pretty hard at this. There's a lot of work to be done and it usually takes them a good hour to get ready for the start of the rehearsal. It's Wednesday, April the 7th, 1999. Jack and Don are busy setting up the spot where the band's actually going to sit, getting the stands in position, and making sure that everything is just ship shape when the band's ready to play. Jack's pretty fussy. He wants those chairs exactly the right spot and the stands right in the right spot. Everything's got to be just exactly correct. This is the truck with all the music boxes on it. It has to be loaded and unloaded from the cars and brought in and distributed to the music stands. Jack is very precise in the way he sets up the chairs in the stands. He likes the blue chairs up on the top row, and he, you can see he's just checking to make sure they're in exactly the right place. Don is busy setting up the small practice amplifier that we use at rehearsal so that the singers can hear the, just how things are going to sound. Now comes the distribution of the music, and it has to be unpacked and packed around to every location. Jack's just putting the music up for the drummer. There's Don with an arm load that covers the front line of the saxophone section. background is Jack putting the boxes away and getting the last bit of the music out. Then he stores the boxes in a certain place so they're ready to go when we reach the trombone section and he's setting up the trombone stands. Jimmy Brown is the first member of the band to show up on this rather cold and stormy night. Jim plays alto sax in the band but he's most famous for the Dixieland work that he's been doing for a number of years. He's a wonderful Dixieland musician. This kid just kept on playing, you know, and yeah. they just come out of it kind of slow, and I thought, where the hell is he? <laughs> <laughs> you know? Oh, boy. Elman Snow is usually one of the first ones to arrive. Elman plays trumpet in the band and just celebrated his 84th birthday last week. Uh, we're, ex we're expecting a visit tonight from Craig Wirtz of Channel 4. He's done a show on us before and he's decided he's going to do another one. We hope he shows up. Yeah. Our piano player Bob Davis just walked in and he'll entertain us for a few minutes while everybody's collecting. You want me to move? Maybe I should sit over here. I here comes I, the drums. <laughs> I think my head's going to be right in the... 
Here comes our youngest and handsomest man, our drummer, Jan Hine. He's joined us recently, and he's a little bit younger than our ass, but not a lot. Hey, hey. Ooh, I need some guidance. You need some guidance? Well, they're coming in fast now, and you'll hear the practice notes while everybody's getting warmed up. Leader Doug Ball just came in. He's got his horn out and he's going to blow a few notes for us. a little impromptu saxophone section rehearsal on a new arrangement that our arranger Gene Burton and we'll try to get him in a little closer so you can see who he is <laughs> Since he's entered our band, we've come up with some wonderful additions. He's worked with many of the big bands in the country, including Harry James, Horace Hyde, and many others. He's a top musician. We are, part, are a part of the Granite Adult Education Program. And every night, we have somebody come in that has been a musician in the past to visit with us. This one's a man, I haven't met him yet, but he's evidently a guitar player. Be back in school. Be Doug takes a few minutes just talking at the beginning of each rehearsal. Uh, reminding us of the dates that we have scheduled. The actual address 429. And it's on the south side of the school. South 18th. On the south side of the school, there's a road that goes in south of the school. They'll have a gate open. You just drive in there and park. Like that, we got guests. What number? 
Two, one, two, three, four. 